Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy, Killer Tarantino. Playing a little solos today. Getting the win, hopefully. We're going to be trying a pinwheel rotation on the map and uh, play a little conservative, maybe a little aggressive, depending on what the uh, situation calls for. So, uh, here we go. Normally don't like to do this, but this guy just made it too easy, so I figured I'd take the free kill right at first. By the way, I hate people that do this crap anyway. Right now the uh, goal is to land closer to the outside of the map so I can uh, loot up and uh, maybe not encounter too many people until I get my load out. I'm going to be trying to explain to y'all the uh, pinwheel rotation and how I rotate out of the circles. Not sure about y'all, but I really can't stand the bison, so I get rid of that as soon as I can. Um, been working with the ram lately, so I picked that up. With the right setup, man, this gun, maybe the new meta in Warzone. Super fast fire rate, um, pretty controllable recoil. I like to land and get scavenger contracts. You get the most gear and a decent amount of money. Right here, pretty much just checking around, checking behind me. Don't want to get flanked while I push up to get my crate. Boneyard's pretty hot, so uh, I'm on high alert right now. Don't want to get tunnel vision, scan the area. the MP7 before I get my load out. Fast fire rate, rate real good in close quarters. So right now I have a uh, bounty on my head. Uh, threat level is yellow, so they're somewhere probably 100, 200 yards away, so I'm pushing this way. much pushing south by the time I get up here. I'm looting around. You notice my threat level is now orange, so I know this guy more than likely is south of me. I'm gonna go up here, finish my contract. Yeah, he's definitely south. Threat level turned red. I don't know where this guy is. He knows where I'm at, so I am taking off right now, trying to get some space. 
I'd like to find some high ground, something easily defendable. Don't really know if this guy is uh, too good or not, but it seems like he's pushing me, so he has to have some confidence. So, pick this little area. I can see to the south in the direction he should be coming from. Um, just going to kind of hide out in here. Play it a little safer, a little more conservative. Um, threat's red. He's getting close. Got my eyes pe peeled. Got my ears open. Got the Arctic's Pro Wireless on high. You can hear all the footsteps from every direction with the 3D audio. Major game changer. So I'm looking, looking. Starting to hear something, and there he is. So here it is. Gonna put some shots on him. He jumps right. I put more shots on him. Dude jumping around like an idiot. Switch to secondary. Finish him off. Thanks, buddy. I'll take your armor crate, and I guess I'll take your shield turret, which is really a turd. Don't even know why I'd pick that up. Um, grab a few more plates. Now, with his money, I have enough to go snag up my loadout. Just need to check my guns, reload them. Don't ever want to forget that, man. That's, that's a heartbreaker when you're about to win a gunfight, and... Um, Got no bullets. I don't want to leave this ammo box. I wanted to get in cover to throw uh, this, but sorry, armor box. But so I throw it here so I can pick the armor box back up. You never know how when those are going to come in handy. Going to grab my ram, decked out. Now I have this other bounty, I'm going to go push him and see where he's at. I won't necessarily engage him unless I feel like I have a clean shot, which right now I'm pretty sure he's held up in a building. So I'm going to push around, loop my way up to him, and uh, hopefully not be seen. Right, I know I'm getting close here. I'm gonna check my heart monitor. He's in this building directly in front of me now. I'm gonna post up in this window, see if I can get a shot. See if he'll peek his head out. Um, seems pretty scared, so I feel like he's not too confident in his gun skills. But I feel like it's obvious he's camping. Uh, no need to force a 50-50 gunfight or, you know, one that he could be camping at the top of the stairs with a 75% advantage over me. Um, he sees me, puts some shots on me, I'm going to get out of there. Um, he more than likely has the high ground and I don't know where that shot came from. So, um, tactical retreat pretty much. Checking, checking, don't see him. Nothing on the heart monitor. So, um, figure probably go get this loadout because I'd like to get my ghost but I also saw two boxes drop so I know more than likely I'm gonna be pushed or run into uh, you know some resistance up here pretty confident with this gun very accurate takes them down easy so just gonna scan the area, see what I see. At the moment, it doesn't see like anything except for the bounty. He ends up pushing the other way, so I'm gonna take this time to go snag up my loadout. And then I notice a car coming up on me. Grab my loadout, turn around, hit him with the C4. That's that. 
getting my load out and right about now I'm hearing someone parachute down onto me so um, I just Bro, beat what? his ass with a rocket launcher pick my guns back up now I have my ghost that Bruins a really good gun also but it's slow it's just so accurate I was running that before I decided to switch back to the Ram I'm gonna get rid of this armor box so no one else can use it. Um, I know there's another armor box. So I'll go pick that up. Checking the circle, checking where my rotations could be. I got money. I want to go by myself. Revive, possibly a UAV. Throw a little trap down just in case. So when you're moving through here, um, a lot of people get tunnel vision, they'll just look straight and uh, not know what's going on. I see a car, dude jumps out, I'm gonna put him down, eliminate that threat. Let's go see what kind of goods he's got, get his money, UAV, free UAV, can't beat that. Wouldn't mind getting that uh, dead silence, but I think carrying this... Uh, this ammo crate would work out better, just in case. Would also like to carry the trophy system. You know, just in case I need a car or hold up in a building for safety, those trophy systems are pretty much invaluable. So I get what I need. I already have the UAV. Picked up my self revive. Um, it was a jailbreak. So I saw a guy land over here calling the UAV. See where he's at. Trying to creep, but trying to push because I know he just has a pistol. Um, there ends up being another guy over here that kills him, so I'm going to try to clear this house. Creep in. Got distracted by some money because I'm pretty much a loot whore. I'm creeping up the stairs. He definitely has an advantage if he's camping, but he's not there. He's the house over. So that's clear. Um, Gas is closing. Get to the new safe zone. Scan the area. Don't see him. But now I notice the truck that's parked over there. So this guy had to come in, and there he is. I'm going to try to put him down. Not the best shooting. Miss him a lot. He gets away. I would have thrown a C4, but he had a uh, trophy system on top. So, you know, we'll deal with him later. I'm going to go in and uh, pick up this bounty contract so I can you know, get an idea where the next team is. Or the next person is. You know, and if I know where they're at, I have a, have a chance I'll push them. If I feel like, you know, it could be a gunfight in my favor. So I'm pushing in. I think this guy may be moving to the buy box. I want to catch him there. Um, but he ends up retreating. Probably saw my level getting, or his level getting high. Um, he takes off. Makes me think he's another uh, timid player. Probably lacking a little skill because he doesn't want any engagements, it seems. So I'm going to push up back in the boneyard. The circle is closing. I'm 
here's some gunshots, so uh, I'm gonna go check it out. But not push too aggressive. A lot of campers in single player. Um, they'll catch you off guard, so the best way to deal with a camper is to not deal with the camper, just wait till they get out in the open. And normally you can beat them in a gunfight, because, like I said, timid, scared, um, not confident in their skill. Of course you get those one campers that just, uh, or those one players that even though they're not com confident, they don't care, they'll just bum rush you and, you know, hope for the best. So right now I'm looking, I see, I don't really want to run through Boneyard, so I'm going to go out towards the edge of the circle to start my pinwheel rotation. I'm going to get out here and then I'm going to push, Enemy UAV overhead. um, to the right, round out the circle, push down below promenade where my bounty is. And the theory behind the pinwheel is you want to stay in front of the storm a little bit and uh, you know you basically have already cleared behind me. Um, anyone on the right's being pushed they could be easy picking so I want to just look left and in front of me and then behind me is clear yeah, because I've already be been there ahead. so it really only it, it narrows down your angles you have to watch Light vehicle here. so what I was doing was marking where I thought the bounty was going because I'm gonna lose them here in the next half minute storm started pushing a little faster so kinda messed up my pinwheel but I'll get back ahead of it and you can see how this pays off here in a minute. I'm going to push up. Moving. Um, there's going to be a guy camping behind a tree. He doesn't expect me because, you know, the gas is just right behind me. Pretty much stay checking my heart beat monitor, even though I called in a UAV earlier. No, most people um, are running ghost, but, you know, I catch this guy lacking. Um, put him down. Easy kill. No worries. Sorry for shooting you in the back, buddy, but hey, it's a war zone. You gotta die. I mean, everyone has to die, right? Except for me. Gas is closing. Get to the new Not continuing on with the pinwheel, moving forward. Um, there's a buy cart up here. I want to be cautious. People could camp it. People could be there buying something. I am charging pretty aggressive. Um, I see stuff in here, more than likely no one's been here. So I feel confident I can move freely to the next building. What I'm really looking for is enough money to buy another UAV so I can pop the one I have and get an idea where the people are. So right now I'm avoiding the middle. I'm going back to the storm to reset my pinwheel just checking behind me just to make sure no one else is rotating the same way Gas is moving. basically want to stay on the outside of this hill that way if I get in an encounter I can drop down find cover replay it if I need to um, but in the back of my mind right now I'm thinking that bounty contract was over here I don't know where he went I just know he's in the general area so I'm on heightened alert right now. Following the tracks, I have cover on my left. There's going to be no one on the right. It's pretty much stay on my heart monitor. Checking things out. right there I was trying to make sure he wasn't held up in there have a good feeling someone's gonna be camping in this building everyone camps in the buildings so you just gotta watch yourself doing a little creeping playing a little conservative
no one got pushed out of the house, so we're good there. to the outside to reset my pinwheel. Friendly drop back headed your way. Another group of houses. Three crates fallen. I figure someone will be going after them. Push in slightly. Check the map. Figure out where I want to go. I'd like to push right still. I know people are going to be fighting over there. In the hills. Dude on map. <clears throat> this guy's a jackass really. He's trying to be funny and cute. But uh, he gets his. Enemy soldier incoming. Right, so I find them, dude, parachuting in. Put some bad shots on them. It's all good. Regroup, take them down. I got flash because here comes homie with his damn sticks. Yeah, sit down, dude. People heard the gunshots, people heard the commotion. Dropped two guys right there, so I figure people may be looking. Now I'm going to go in this house because I feel like I hear the box humming, so I'm going to go in there, feel like it's clear, still being cautious. Clear right. I'm going to go upstairs and try to hop around this corner, but I hit my head on the roof. Pretty much noob. I thought process here is get out the uh, house without busting a window. Don't want to draw any more attention to myself than I have to. I uh, don't want to waste my gas mask, so don't go there. Find the front door. scan behind me because um, you never know who's going to be pinwheeling the same way you are or running the same tactic. I see a guy running over there. I want to play it slow. I'm going to get out of his line of sight in case he looks. I want to push this guy. I want to kill him so he's not a threat on my six anymore. He's not on heartbeat. Running ghost. There he is. So I'm going to push up. I want to shoot him in the ear. Then I noticed the sniper glint in the window. Boom, get out of there. It's not a fight I want. I have no cover, so it's just back to the hills. I'll deal with him later. Or someone else can kill him. I really want to take just the fights I can win. So basically, I'm out in the open field. Um, I know gas is going to move. It could be a dangerous push through here. See I talk about fighting later. There he is, fighting the sniper. Easy kill. Duck down, reload, try to stay stealthy. So I'm checking for movement from this building. I saw the sniper. I'm going to call in my UAV. I'm going to hop on my map, count what I got. There's five people left, and there's three on the UAV. Excuse me, there's two on the UAV. I'm going to mark their location. Just for a reference. I know a sniper's in here. Goal here is to push up behind this fence and get cover. This is where it all comes down. 
you had to have solid gameplay, heads up awareness, um, maybe a little luck, as you'll see here in the end. So I know those, I know there's guys in there, two of them. I guess they haven't fought any people left, but it, only three people left. So storm stops. I thought maybe it'd go and push them out, and I could get a free kill on it. This didn't quite happen that way. So I'm just going to creep to the edge. Check my six. Listening real good. Creep over here. So they're in this house. I know they have to come out. I'm going to push in front of them. Push through the gas. Try to get on the uh, on the outside of this house and wait for them to jump out. So one behind me, one in the house. So I'm going to chill here. Storm's pushing. Slowly push forward with creeping. And I find the find the guy. Gas mask glitch screws me up. St get, I get put down, and well done. I guess the storm gets him. Self res comes in handy. Warzone victory, boys. That's how it done. Um, wasn't the perfect game, but I'd say about 90% of it was. So hope y'all enjoyed the video. If y'all like to see more vids like this, please like and subscribe. Drop a comment in the section. I'm open for critiques. If you see anything I could do better, see anything I did good, let me know. Um, I appreciate y'all taking the time to watch this video. Hopefully, um, me giving you my ideas can y'all can take that, learn from it, implement this, and you know catch more wins. Pretty much textbook though. But anyhow, this is Killa Tarantino, a.k.a. KT for short, signing off. I'll see y'all in the war zone. Thanks for watching.